better solution is commercial ghillie suit modified to take care of a few of these problems. Trim some of the ghillie out. Coloration. Okay, generally this stuff has got a shine to it. I promise you any observer with a spotting scope that's been doing this for a while is going to pick up on some of this shine. I'd be taking this out, rolling it in the sandbox, dragging it behind my quad runner for a little bit, dusting it up. Okay, never wash your ghillie suit, especially in the washing machine. You're going to end up with a burned out washing machine motor, your wife will kill you, I promise. Okay, got to take some of the shine off. Why did I go with desert pattern? I'm up here in Canada, literally just beside that door, on the other side of that door, it's minus 27 degrees outside, 11 inches of snow. Farthest thing from desert that you can imagine. As a rule, with camel patterns, ghillie suit's no exception. It's easier to make a light pattern darker than it is to take a dark pattern and try and lighten it up. The mossy or the woodland ghillie suit patterns that you see on the market right now are generally too dark, even for the environments that they're intended for. Very good for like a Pacific Coast, Northwest rainforest sort of setting. But other than that, that kind of thickness is just out of place and that kind of dark coloration. Uh, same criticism of mossy oak, the general mossy oak pattern that they've first put out, far too dark and it's very, very difficult to lighten it up. So I got the desert pattern knowing full well that I could add material to this to darken it up. I could dye some of the thread if I needed to darken it up. I could add the greens if I had to, but in general, I stay with the tans, the browns, and the grays. Those are the colors that are there all year round. The branches, twigs, bark, all of those things don't go away. The leaves come and go. I can add green and take it away as I need to, but a universal pattern is going to be the browns, the grays, and the tans. That's why I went with desert, knowing that I could modify it.